Is oh. Mark DeHuga up on the Gold Coast in yeah, your vicinity? What are your memories of, um, of of first discovering him and his um, his guitar ability? Uh, this is a funny story. Look, Mark DeHuga, I went to a party with my girlfriend in Paddington and there was this guy that was hanging around the scene at the time, some Jewish, old Jewish guy that reckoned he was a band manager and he was just, he just liked hanging around parties and talking himself up. But anyhow, he introduced me He introduced me to this guy. He said, oh, look, I've got this guy I'm looking after now. He's a guitar player. And I said, oh, yeah. And he, he, he took me over and he introduced me to Mark. And Mark looked like some guy that had just walked out of a kebab shop, you know, in, in horrible blue leather pants. He, he just looked like some kebab shop owner. And, um, and, and he, he said, I started talking to him and he said, yeah, I'm into this, that, and the other. And I, and I thought, oh, yeah, what... Yeah, and he says, "Look, I'll give you a tape." And I, anyhow, I grabbed the tape. In those days, we had cassettes in our car, cassette players in the car. And me and my girlfriend left the party, and we were driving back home. And I put this tape on. I said, "This is crap. This guy sped the tape up. No way. I can't <laughs> believe this is the guy playing. This has got to be sped up." So the next day, I rang him up, and I said, "I really like the tape, but you know, why did you speed it up? You know, you sped it up, haven't you? Your guitar playing's not that fast." He said, no, that's how I play. It's not sped up. And I said, yeah, right. I said, he said, why don't you come over to my, my you know, grandmother's house or something and, and I'll show you. And so I said, oh, all right. So I went over and I was just absolutely go- gobsmacked at what this little kid could do. You know, he was just like unbelievable. And I just said to the guys, this guy's going to be our new guitarist. I said, it's perfect. He's underage. He's absolutely unbelievable he's like the angus young of the 80s this guy's got got to be in the band you know i said not only is he a great guitar player he's going to be a great gimmick you've got to have him so that's how he got in